Hi Gemini, welcome to your reading and this is for Gemini Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus placement in their chart, Jupiter may resonate with the reading, cross watchers are always welcome, cross watchers if I describe someone and you know that it is not you, it is not you, just because you are connecting with a Gemini you're gonna assume that whom I'm describing here is you, please don't, this is not a personal reading. For those of you who is new to the channel, welcome, you might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming and in the live stream you can ask me questions. If you missed the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There's a link in the description box, click that link, you will be routed to my page, type in your questions and then click submit. So Gemini, let's begin. Your first card is the Two of Swords. Gemini, what's really happening here is that you know for a fact that you're not on the same page with your person energetically. There is discussions, disagreement, challenges. Um, probably you're not understanding. Both of you are not understanding each other. It could be energetic separation. It could also be a physical separation wherein there's now... I think that's self-explanatory, physically separated. Whether you are in a different city, state, county, country, different continent, or you are in a long distance connection. And for you, you're having a hard time to make a decision of what? Decision of, or probably having a hard time. How can you achieve this 10 of pentacles, which is the highest form of the abundance? The highest form of the abundance here. What is abundance to you? Abundance may feel or may be different from each other, uh, I mean, from every person, right? Abundance may mean literally money. Abundance may mean um, time, energy, love, connection, cohabitation, um, commitment, right? You're having a hard time because of this misunderstanding, because of the separation. Um, having a hard time also to have fun, to have victory, because there's a lot of things to be discussed there's a lot of things to be to consider there's a lot of things for you to fix in this connection probably also not just in the connection but also to yourself a lot of questions that needs an answer so that someone here can make a decision because they are really having a hard time now also probably because of the separation someone for a few numbers of you would really love to make a decision of moving on but of course since there's no, um, I think that there's no closure yet in this connection, right? Suddenly just disappear. Someone here is trying to, let's say, okay, I want to move on, but what if my person comes back, right? I want to move on. However, I still love the person. Um, should I consider my happiness or my person's happiness? this is how you truly love the person um, you are considering them on top of you with the four of cups but i can sense here that someone is also cannot see the other person's effort um, it could be because of again of the separation or they're just really don't care that's the saddest part of this they don't really care the other person cares a lot the other person kind of like the other person has a 10 or 100 percent of care the other person like 10 percent to none um happiness is what you wanted see you might be having a hard time should i consider this um selfish person if i may say right this could be you this could be the cross watchers cross watchers if you feel like this is your reading so be it and gems if you feel like you are in the cross watcher side that's okay i am not reading which side you at i am reading the energy for those of you who's new to the channel welcome you might want to consider subscribing for i am always hosting a party online wherein i'm doing a live streaming and in the live stream you can ask me questions if you missed the live streaming you can still ask me questions there's a link in the description box click that link you'll be routed to my page type in your questions and then click submit 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading 
So gems, if you also want to know your lucky numbers and lucky color, follow me on Instagram. If you also want to know your financial forecast, follow me on Instagram as well. If you are into twin flame readings, almost personal readings, pick a card and channel messages. Please subscribe to the other channel, Timeless Tarot 111. And if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, you can come back to the reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading, still congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. So gems, let's continue. Gemini, I can also see here with the Five of Cups. There's now regret. Why did I put myself into this situation? Why did I love my person so much? Wherein they became, you know, um, selfish. They became, um, and this, they became that I am the one. It, it's kind of, it, it became my job to cater to them with a the high priestess here. Your intuition is telling you to do so, to make a decision, probably of letting go, probably of giving your heart back or, you know, um, prioritizing yourself with a chariot here of probably like what I mentioned, moving away. I can sense here that you have to be firm in your, your intuition because I can sense here 180 degree turn and you're going to surpass these challenges. I know this is not easy because it is such a heartbreak to leave someone behind, but I can sense here that you might be with the two of ones here. You might be in a situation that you wanted to do this already. Follow your intuition. Let's clarify the two of swords. Two of swords here is your, kind of the universe is tapping you, you know, tapping your shoulders, trying to communicate with you, but probably by angel numbers. Seven of pentacles, don't wait anymore because you have given your, your you planted your seed, give them their, um, the, the right amount of love, right time, attention, affection, with a four of cups, but they are not seeing it, and probably this is intentional, intentional, kind of like, probably at first, they're trying to um, intentionally disregard this until it became a hobby, you know, a habit and uh, to them. Now you're in this, be very strategic. Because with the Page of Cups, your person is going to give you and offer you the cup once again, one day at a time. Or taking the cup back one day at a time. I know it's not easy, but for you to achieve the Four of Cups, you have to open the doors um, physically and energetically. Physically open your doors so that they can be shaken. If they see that you are somehow open um, to meet someone new, they're going to be shaken. You're going to cut this person's horn with a four of wands here. You're going to achieve this um, strong foundation, cohabitation, proposal, and marriages. You might be connecting here with any water placements or you have a water placements in your chart. Um, cancer or has a cancer placement in their chart or you have a cancer placement in your chart. Leo or has a Leo placement in their chart or you have a Leo placement in your chart. Capricorn or has a Capricorn placement in their chart or you have a Capricorn placement in your chart. Libra or has a Libra placement in their chart or you have a Libra placement in your chart. Um, or any water placements here, but this is your reading. If you resonate with this and you want to go in depth, you can book a person reading with me. If you're okay with the reading and you just have a question or two, there's a link in the description box. Click that link. We'll be routed to my page. Type in your questions. Click submit. 500 likes for this video, and your next video will be a full reading. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you on the next reading. Goodbye, gems.